Hi there. Today we're going to go over creating and assigning holidays, as well as how to distribute holiday timesheets manually if you so choose. So to begin, we'll go to the company tab at the top and holidays. We will click add. We will create our holiday. And you'll put in a description there. You can choose either a single date option or a recurring option. Then you're going to check include and holiday processing. You're going to choose the time you want the timesheet to begin. And then you're going to select the job code that you want associated with those hours. And you'll click save. Now we need to set up a holiday hours processing rule. So we'll click that button. So I currently have it set to run daily, every day at 5 a.m. starting today. Now, it is important to note that holiday hour processing will only process prior dates. So today's holiday will process tomorrow. I'll click Save. Now, to assign this holiday manually, you'll go to Employee, Employee Profiles. You'll choose your employee. You'll go to Leave, Holidays, Assign, choose the holiday, and Assign. And you'll save. It's also important to note the job code that you put on the holiday also needs to be assigned to the employee. So you'll see the holiday job code there. Now to assign this holiday globally, we will go under the employee tab and then to global modification. We will choose the employees we want to receive it. Click next, leave, holidays, assign holidays, Next, you'll choose your holiday, you'll click next, and you'll click process. So now that will be there. Now, if you wanted to distribute timesheets manually, say it's an impromptu holiday or something of that nature, you can do that by going to hours, mass hours. You will choose the employees you want to receive the timesheet. You'll click Next, choose Add Hours, Next. Now I'm going to mark this as a timesheet entry. I'm going to put my date as yesterday in this case. We're going to say starting at 8 a.m. I want it to be for eight hours, and I want it to be in the holiday code. So I will choose all that. Then I click Next, and then I click Process. We click OK, and if we were to go to that employee's individual hours, we would see that timesheet there. And that is holidays in a nutshell.